Peace and blessings, you ugly mofos, and welcome to another episode of He Rants. I'm your host, Felix Long Trousers. Man, check this out, man. This is your first time on He Rants. I'm going to let you know. I'm just a random guy who likes to talk about random stuff that interests me, and I just feel like I need to inform you guys about it. If that sounds sexy or attractive to you, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as with the post notifications. That way, you always be on the first to hear the voice. Same time, leave a like, because I'm so damn insecure, and those likes definitely let me know I'm doing a stand-up job. Same time, you got to buy the merch. Mofo, men offering females orgasms because we're so humble. Email me, description box below. But let's not waste no more time. We got another reaction video, man. We're reacting to a TikTok uh, by this young lady that I don't really know her name. I don't really give a damn about her name, right? Uh, but what I'm really here for is the content, right? So this video, man, uh, this TikTok rather, we are reviewing, not reviewing. I, I already said we're reacting to. I don't know why I'm repeating myself, right? But it's you guys already seen the the, 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 the thumbnail. You already seen the freaking title of the video and stuff, right? This video is about being fat phobic, right? That working out, apparently working out to look good, makes you fat phobic in this logic, at least. Uh, somebody kill me. um off the rip i haven't watched this video i was told about this video and i i, I know this video is going to get me upset i know i'm going to get triggered um so if anybody gets upset of the stuff that i'm going to say because i'm triggered i want to allow you to know uh, that i don't care and 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 you can hug my nuts you can hug my nuts Still don't understand why going to the gym makes me fat phobic. I literally worked hard for my body. Why are you trying to shame me for it? Going to the gym does not make you fat phobic. Going to the gym so that you can look a certain way and have a certain body image does make you fat phobic because there's absolutely nothing healthy about a certain body size. You know what? She's absolutely right. You know, to, to a person who's mentally challenged, she is absolutely right. All right. See, I never understood why people try to take their own life until this very moment. Um, I definitely I definitely have a feeling of that right now. I, I don't know, because if this is what we have, um, I think we're down a bad path. We're definitely down a bad path. This girl's a complete idiot. Uh, she's stupid. Uh, she's remedial. Uh, she has very nice hair, though. very nice curly hair. I like it. I like how it is. I don't know what she uses, L'Oreal or or uh, Garnier or Fructis or whatever she uses. Um, the hair is very nice. I have to give her that. Um, as far as her saying this stuff is fat phobic, no. This fat phobic stuff is stupid, all right? It's not real. You're scared? You have an irrational fear of fat people? Eh, maybe, maybe. There's probably somebody who is, people who are really fat phobic. The actual, what fat phobia would really be, which would be like, you're just legit. Oh my God, a fat person like that, probably. You know what I'm saying? That really would be a rational fear. But because the people are not a lot liking the fact that you are obese, that doesn't mean that they have an irrational fear of you. All right. You're obese. All right. You're, 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 you're fat. That's it. And it's only fat phobic for women. It's not fat phobic for men. Have you noticed that? There's only fat phobic for women. If you call a man fat, it's not a big deal. You're being fat phobic. Your body shame. So body shame is only against women. Have you noticed that? I don't understand that. Now, if I want to work out and look good, Right, and look good. Show people that I am disciplined, because that's really what it is, right? When you see somebody who's obese, they look at the, you, look at them, be like, they're not disciplined. They're not disciplined. There's gonna be somebody who's like, oh, but what about when a woman just has a has a baby and stuff, and they're just really busy with life, so they don't have time to work out? No, stop it, stop it. The weight weight is mainly diet. Let's keep it a stack. It's like seventy percent diet, and the other percent, <laughs> what was that? The other thirty percent is working out. You could lose weight by just dieting right, eating the right food. You choose not to. Oh, but I'm too busy to cook and all that stuff. Like, bro, you don't have to cook. You can go out to places, this place that have healthy food choices. You choose not to, right? You choose not to, because you want to go to the easy route, because it tastes good. Then you get big, it's your fault. And then when dudes find you less attractive, because dudes are very, very visual, right? Oh, dudes are shallow. Eat a dick, all right? Eat a dick, all right? You be eating all this stuff all the time. You might as well eat a dick. Oh my God, this guy feels his fat phobic. You're damn right I am, right? I'm going by y'all definition when I say that. I'm not really fat phobic, but I mean, hey, you're damn right I am, son. Because you guys are getting to the point now that if I want to work out and look good, now I'm fat phobic. Come on now. 
Oh, because it doesn't. He goes, they're skinny people who are just as unhealthy. I hate when people do that. Does that the does that take away from the fact that you are obese and unhealthy? The uh, isn't the highest cause of death like heart disease? And uh, what's the main cause of heart disease? Isn't it obesity? Being overweight? Like stop it! Like stop it! Oh, but you see skinny guys smoking cigarettes and shut up! Stop it! You're fat ass in the gym. Crazy, bro. Like. Well, I can't believe it. Body size. No, that's just how you measure success at the gym. No, success surrounding physical fitness can be measured and should be measured by your ability to lift more, to do more reps, to run faster, to make the activities easier. When you're just focused on size, yeah, yeah, that would make me fat phobic. So now I'm a bad person and I just shouldn't work out. Fat phobia is not a derogatory term. So why bring up the point that I might be fat phobic? Because fat phobia is a social justice issue and some people want to leave this world a better place for their children. Uh, yes, social justice issue. Didn't you call me a racist too? Okay. All right. She's. It's not. It's not a derogatory term. I guess I. Don't, I don't know. Does she blows me? She really blows me. Um, guys, guys and ladies, whoever's watching the video, I just want to say, uh, we're heading down to a path that women are. We're, we're, we're really dropping the standards, right? We're really, we're really dropping the standards. The reason why I say women, uh, you know, because a lot of people will say, "Oh, Felix, you always look more women," so like, because this is this is mainly a video for women. Let's keep let's keep it a stack. I mean, well, it's a video for men of how to view stuff about women. That's how, at least how I take it, right? Because at the end of the day, and and uh, working out and stuff like, that, I mean, I, I I don't know, or maybe it's towards women. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's towards men and women. So I don't, I'm just all over the place because she just. Most people working out, right? Um, it is to get healthy, right? It is to get healthy. Uh, but I feel like it's 50 50 getting healthy and also looking good, right? Um, it's, it is what it is. You're going to call these people fat phobic? I guess I've seen people calling Adele fat phobic. I've seen people calling. Uh, 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 what's, what, what's her name? Uh, Nikki Parker, Monique, <laughs> Monique, fat phobic because these things they're out here losing weight and stuff like why y'all losing weight, blase blase. It's the real reason why they're upset about fat phobia is because then it holds them accountable. If they see everybody else losing weight, then it puts a lot more pressure on them to lose weight. Uh, and they can't have that, so they have to tell everybody else. Got to shame everybody else. Tell them that they shouldn't lose weight and all that stuff. But let's be real, son. They just don't want to lose weight because they like. They like food, right? They battled food and lost. They lost ferociously. It was a massacre, right? Food is over here walking around the ring out here, like, you know, kissing, blowing kisses to their husband and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's how food is just out here playing them for fools. It's crazy. Stay safe out there. It's like, bruh, y'all just want to be able just to be fat in peace and have fun being fat if you work out right for health reasons you're most likely going to lose weight you're most likely going to look better right i think a lot of people understand that you're most likely going to lose weight you're going to look better you're going to look more attractive and everything right if you want to lose your weight to look more attractive in general that's not fat phobic right fat phobic to me is like i i think it's really a, a fake thing that women have just made just so we allow so we can allow women to be fat in peace without saying nothing about it it's a lot of them to be fat you know what i'm saying i don't want anybody to come up and to allow me uh, uh let me know that i'm you know overweight and stuff i don't like it it hurts my feelings you know what i'm saying not realizing that even if it is hurting your feelings right let's say dudes coming up being a-holes right and saying like oh you fat you fat blase blase right i'm not condoning it right i'm not condoning it but at the same time i want people to understand that by them doing that i'm pretty sure it, mo it can motivate you to lose weight right it can motivate you to lose weight there's also the other side where it can motivate you to do some other bad stuff you know what i'm saying but uh let's not go into that one right it will definitely motivate you uh to lose weight you see women on tv right all right Let's, let's be real right there's a lot of women on tv bodies unrealistic some of them unrealistic some of them have gotten work done right but even though i feel like if you look at some of these women who are actual fitness people right you know what i'm saying real fitness people not the not the models that you know probably got work done the real fitness people that really dedicate their life on dieting working out and everything you see their bodies they look good 
You know what I'm saying? You see some of the uh, WNBA players, not all of them, uh, but like let me uh, let me say one specific one, Tia Cooper, for example. You look at her body, well proportioned, perfectly made. You know what I'm saying? Cause she works out well. She's very athletic. All that, right? She looks great. A lot of dudes is not gonna say that her body looked bad. You see the rump on that joint side? It's a rump stumper, a rumper dump dumper, super dumper, dump trucker. You know what I'm saying? I would definitely, man. I would. I say marmalade a lot, but this time I, for her plum juice, I'm drizzling her with plum juice. Just drizzle. You know what I'm saying? That's me with a paintbrush, right? Because after I drizzle, I wanted to spread it evenly. You know what I'm saying? On that rump dumper. You feel me? So, this woman coming up here saying that, yo, if you're doing this fat phobic, these people out here, I feel like they, in a sense, feel like they're doctors, right? They can diagnose you. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're suffering from a thing that we call fat phobia, right? You have an irrational fear of women who are obese. Because we don't care if it's a man that you call fat. We don't care about that. We care about women. Women are the ones who are fat. Uh, that you call fat. Oh my god, I almost, oh jeez. It's got fat phobic right there, my goodness. Like, come on, man. Come on. We gotta live in reality, not la la land, right? These people who are obese, they're unhealthy. They're unhealthy. Oh, what about the people who got the uh, uh, freaking uh, uh, medication? That's the reason why they're fat. That's a minority. Y'all talk about the 1% minority? What about the rest of those guys? The rest of the fat ones? They're fat. They're chubby. That's what it is, bro. Let's be real, because they eat a lot. They don't have a lot of discipline. You know what I'm saying? They don't like to move a lot. They like to eat abundance, or they like to eat high-calorie foods. Sweets, pastries, the goodies. You feel me? Now, if they decide that they want to start working out to look better, because they realize a lot of dudes is not liking the chubby joints. Oh, there comes the, oh, there's some guys who like, uh, son, son, shut up. It's like 5% of men like ch chubby, like fat joints, man. 5% of men, all right? The other one, the, the men who are out here going out with fat joints, man, ask them, are they going out with these fat joints because they want to go out with these fat joints? Or are they going out with these fat joints because they can't really get things there, you know, that they really want, right? A lot of people know that uh, a lot of fat joints give up the cheeks easier. You know, a lot of them have low self-esteem. It's, it's just come on son it's like this is a thing that we just know so everybody knows this that's why some guys go after fat joints it's an easy kill let's be real but i'll tell you what if that fat joint loses weight works out body starts looking better confidence starts going up right won't put up with some of those guys those guys who are clearly using them for advantage you know what i'm saying like let's be real man let's be real but for some reason, these I don't know, man. And even even as a fat joint, some of these guys that they're, they're messing with are guys that they don't even want. They're dealing with those guys because they know that, man, I can't really get the more attractive guy that I want because he don't want me. He don't want to be out with me and stuff, right? Let's be real. Oh, man. Hey, people are going to be triggered off this video. So I can just tell. I can, I can feel it. People are really upset. I'm like, oh, this guy's an a-hole. He's an asshole, bro, because I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you a lot of people... Confuse the realist with a, with a pessimist, bro. I, I, I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you what other people are not going to tell you. You're obese. It looks less attractive, right? Not only is it less attractive, it, it makes your life a lot harder. Harder to breathe. Harder to do movements. Harder to just do anything, honestly. To be honest, it's just harder to do everything. If you're big enough, it's going to be harder for you to, to get on a plane. You might have to take two seats. You know what I'm saying? You're spending more money because you're buying bad food. Yeah, I know the healthy food costs more money, but you're probably eating more of the bad food. So it probably still equals up. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. This is right. If you want to work out to look good, please do it. Work out, look good. Don't let this dumb, nice haired girl tell you otherwise, man. Work out, look good, man. Feel good for yourself. Your confidence goes up and everything. Your body looks good. You feel better walking up the stairs. You feel me? You can do all that stuff, man. You walk out. Now, you don't have to buy extra large clothes. You know what I'm saying? You can buy clothes that are a little bit more fitted. Show your curves off. You feel me? And this goes for men, too, man. Men, work out, too. You look better. You go to the pool. You feeling like, oh, yeah, boom. You know those guys will be wearing T-shirts in the pool and stuff right there because they know they fat. They don't want everybody to see the, the titties and everything like that. Now, now instead of wearing T-shirts in the pool, now you're just like, effing, I'm pulling out the Speedos. 
I'm, I'm coming through with the speedos, bro. I don't need that. You know, I don't need. I don't even need a swim from speedos, bro. This is all a confidence thing, man. Discipline. It shows you have a lot of discipline if you're able to do that, man. Because it doesn't take anything just to say F it to eat bad and just be lazy. But if you want to look good, you have the discipline. Pff, man, it is what it is, man. But that's all I got to say on this, man. If you stay this long, I appreciate you. I love you. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. So also with the post notification. That way, you'll be one of the first to hear the voice. Same time, leave a like. Because I'm so damn insecure. Those likes definitely let me know I'm doing a stand-up job. Same time, you got to buy the merch. Mofo, men offering females orgasms because we're so humble. Email me. Description box below. That's all I got to say. Peace and blessings, you ugly mofos. And I'm out. Uh